हरे कृष्णा लेट इंटेलिजेंस बी एन इंस्पेक्टर ऑफ इम्पल्स नॉट इट्स इनक्यूबेटर आवर इम्पल्सेज कैन ऑफन मेक एज एक्ट फूलिशली इवन सेल्फ डिस्ट्रक्टिवली समटाइम्स इन क्रिकेट अ वेल सेट बैट्समैन हु इज लीडिंग इज टीम टू विक्ट्री सडनली गेट्स अ रश ऑफ ब्लड एंड इम्पल्सिवली प्लेज अ रैश शॉट एंड गेट्स आउट एंड दैट ट्रिगर द बैटिंग को लैप्स एंड द टीम विच वॉज सेट इन अ विनिंग पोजिशन एंड अप लूजिंग सो वॉट हैपन्स इन स्पोर्ट्स इन अ वेरी ग्राफिक वे कैन ऑल्सो ऑल्सो हैपन्स इन आर लाइफ इन आर इम्पल्सिज मेक अज एक्ट फूलिशली एंड दैट्स वाई वी नीड आवर इंटेलिजेंस टू इंस्पेक्ट आवर इम्पल्सिस इट्स पॉसिबल दैट समटाइम्स वी मे गेट सम impulses which may also tell us something positive usually we don't use the word impulses for them we use may we use the word gut feeling or a hunch uh, something within us says that i this is how you should be doing it but whether even if it is a, a good direction that we are getting from within we still need our intelligence to evaluate it to understand it and then to execute it so if we are too much caught in the heat of the moment in the passion that we will not be able to evaluate it and that's why again even if the impulse is good even if it is a gut feeling we need our intelligence at that time also and the bhagavad gita describes uh, that when we try to practice spiritual life our impulses often sabotage us and the selfish selfish impulses of lust anger greed these are the three gates to hell the gita especially analyzes lust elaborately and significantly in 3.40 it describes the locations of lust indriyani mano buddhir asyadhishthana muchyate etair vimohayatesha gyanam avrutya dehinam so it says indriyani mano buddhir in the senses in the mind and in the intelligence asyadhishthana muchyate the uh, asya adhishthanam is the residing place of lust etair vimohayatesha from here vimohayat is diluted gyanam avrutya dehinam by covering the intelligence of the embodied soul the soul gets diluted so the point is that the gita is saying that even the intelligence can be taken over by uh, by lust when that happens then the intelligence instead of being an inspector of impulse becomes its incubator that means if the impulse is in a nascent state in the background of our consciousness you know the intelligence very secretively uh, keeps it hidden so that we can still maintain an image of integrity and then when we are in private or when the world will when uh, those whose respect we seek do not will not come to know at that time we indulge in that impulse and thus we corrupt our character by, by letting our intelligence be the incubator of impulse to avoid such uh, take over of our intelligence by the intelli- uh, uh, by impulse we need to study bhagavad gita regularly and practice the process of bhakti yoga especially uh, cultivating remembrance of krishna by which we will have the clarity of consciousness then we will be able to recognize impulses and we will recognize how they are often our enemies and then we will our intelligence will be equipped enough to recognize and resist impulse so by studying the gita we will be able to ensure our steady progress in life towards our worthwhile goals by ensuring that our intelligence acts as the inspector of impulse not its incubator thank you hare krishna